Right. Very good. All right. Yeah. And and so that'll start uh, flying with astronauts in 2014, and then uh, you know we're going to continue to expand out, flying to the moon in 2018, and then eventually to Mars right. sometime around 2030. Well, maybe if we're long enough with NASA Edge that we can actually broadcast live on on the moon right. in 2018. And actually, uh, if you could help us out and make sure we could have a, a presence or a doing show actually on the lunar surface, that would be great. You would be, you'd be the guest of honor. You would be our number one fan, if well, you could pull that with off. with your golf clubs, too. Yes. Count um, me in. I hear the view from there is incredible. <laughs> well, I can caddy for you. That's from, right. I, I won't actually try to uh, play anymore. <laughs> so what specifically is your role at, at NASA? Well, I'm the deputy manager of the work that goes on here at NASA Langley Research Center in Hampton, Virginia. Okay. And uh, what we're primarily responsible for is the aerodynamic database for the Ares launch vehicle. So basically what that means is all the wind tunnel testing and analyses to verify, you know, to make sure that when we push that button and we launch with astronauts on board, that that vehicle is going to perform just as, as we planned and safely return astronauts to space. Oh, well, Sounds like a pretty important job. Yeah, exactly. And I, I wonder if Thomas had a database that he used when he pulled me out of quarantine and launched me across the room if... Uh, he knew that that was going to work out as well as it did well, for I'm him. I'm sure that database is quite extensive. Hey, Pat, if you don't mind, this is great stuff. Uh, if you could stick around for a little bit longer after the break, could you come back and answer some email questions? Yeah, sure, absolutely. Perfect. I just stay on board. Uh, don't hang up. We'll be yeah. right back. Great. It's Chris and Blair on NASA Edge. An inside and outside look at all things NASA. Chris and Blair. 